Welcome to Scoop Canada, your most trusted source for the latest news on Canadian politics. Political landscapes often surprise us, and Nahid Nenshi's recent support for Prime Minister Justin Trudeau certainly left many Albertans in shock. His support for Trudeau seemed out of character when viewed through the political lens of Alberta, which tends to be more conservative. Albertans expressed widespread disbelief and disappointment upon learning of Nenshi's endorsement of Trudeau. Alberta's political culture has historically been skeptical of federal liberal policies, particularly those perceived as detrimental to the province's vital oil and gas industries. Trudeau's environmental policies and pipeline regulations have further strained this relationship, making Nenshi support particularly unexpected source. To understand the depth of the reaction, it's essential to grasp Alberta's political environment. For decades, the Federal Conservative Party has found a strong base in Alberta fueled by a combination of economic interests, particularly in the energy sector, and a cultural inclination towards conservatism. The province's affinity for the Conservative Party is ideological and economic. Many Albertans feel that liberal policies neglect or harm Alberta's energy-dependent economy. Consequently, Nenshi's support for Trudeau seemed politically inappropriate and a potential economic betrayal. The implications of Nenshi's stance will be examined from multiple dimensions, touching on his proposed plans, the community's outrage, and the broader political fallout. Former Calgary Mayor Nahid Nenshi took the political landscape in Alberta by storm when he publicly endorsed Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. This move was shocking given Alberta's strong conservative roots and general skepticism towards Trudeau's federal policies, especially those related to energy and environmental regulations. Nenshi's rationale for endorsing Trudeau lies in his belief that collaboration with the federal government is crucial for Alberta's long-term prosperity. He emphasized the need for federal support in diversifying Alberta's economy. Nenshi argued that Trudeau's policies offer a balanced economic and environmental sustainability approach, something Alberta could benefit immensely from. According to Nenshi, aligning with Trudeau might facilitate the necessary federal funding for infrastructure projects and innovation in clean technology, paving the way for a more resilient economy. Nenshi outlined several potential benefits that Trudeau's administration could bring to Alberta. Federal investment in sectors beyond oil and gas could spur innovation and jobs in tech, healthcare, and renewable energy. Collaborating with Ottawa could unlock funds for vital infrastructure projects, improving urban planning and transportation. While Nenshi's support for Trudeau remains controversial, his main argument revolves around the necessity for progress and adaptation in Alberta's political and economic strategies. While Nahid Nenshi's support of Trudeau is a shock in the Canadian political landscape, Scoop Canada remains committed to bringing unfiltered and timely news on hot Canadian political topics. Stay tuned as we delve into the controversies generated by Liberal Party members. As the political climate in Alberta continues to heat up, the conversation shifts to how the public and various stakeholders are reacting to Nenshi's endorsement and what this means for his future and that of Alberta. Nahid Nenshi's unexpected endorsement of Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has sparked notable disappointment among many Albertans. Known for their predominantly conservative views, Alberta's residents found Nenshi's open support for Trudeau perplexing. This sentiment is grounded in historical tensions where federal liberal policies have often antagonized Alberta's energy sector, seen by many as the backbone of the province's economy. Albertans have long opposed Trudeau's liberal government, primarily due to perceived economic threats. Federal regulations, particularly those surrounding carbon taxes and pipeline approvals, are seen as detrimental to Alberta's oil and gas industry. Many believe these policies undermine the province's economic stability. Albertans feel a deep-rooted sense of alienation, believing that federal policies favor central Canada at Alberta's expense. This sentiment has only heightened with Trudeau's tenure, exacerbating the divide between the province and Ottawa. Nenshi's endorsement swiftly ignited social media. Platforms like Twitter saw a surge in critical commentary directed at Nenshi's stance. Comments range from expressions of betrayal to calls for political action. The backlash wasn't confined to digital realms. Local protests soon emerged, with citizens taking to the streets in some areas to voice their frustrations. These protests underscored the tangible displeasure felt by many and emphasized the tangible repercussions of Nenshi's controversial stance. They were describing an Alberta where everyone is against us. An Alberta where we need to fight outsiders all the time. In Alberta, where we should be scared of change instead of embracing and leading the future. 
Nenshi's support for Trudeau hints at a potential shift within Alberta's political landscape. Traditionally a conservative stronghold, the province has shown few signs of liberal acceptance. Yet this endorsement could encourage other politicians to consider more centrist or collaborative approaches, particularly economic diversification and climate policy. This situation also opens the door for political realignment. If more leaders follow Nenshi's lead, it could signify a gradual transformation in Alberta's political identity. The province might see increased moderate and progressive voices complicating the previously straightforward conservative dominance. Unsurprisingly, Trudeau's reception in Alberta has generally been frosty. Many Albertans regard his government's policies as detrimental to the oil and gas industry, a significant pillar of their economy. Nenshi's endorsement does little to quell these concerns. Instead, it has amplified them, drawing more attention to the existing rift between Ottawa and Alberta. As this controversial endorsement unfolds, the political implications stretch far beyond immediate reactions. It beckons a closer examination of Alberta's future political dynamics and evolving relationship with Ottawa. The controversy is a potent reminder of how individual political stances can ripple through and influence broader provincial and national conversations. The media's portrayal of Nahid Nenshi's endorsement of Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has been varied and multifaceted. Locally, Alberta-based outlets like the Calgary Herald and Edmonton Journal have depicted the endorsement with skepticism and caution, highlighting the strong opposition from the conservative base. These articles often emphasize the outrage from Alberta's energy sector and the general populace, framing Nenshi's endorsement as a significant political misstep. Also, discover our exclusive collection of mugs, hoodies, and various daily accessories designed for Canadian Conservative Party supporters. Show your pride with our conservative-themed products at an affordable price. Enjoy free delivery across Canada. Nahid Nenshi's endorsement of Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has undeniably shaken Alberta's political landscape. Known for his previous role as Calgary's progressive mayor, Nenshi's support for Trudeau surprised a province dominated by conservative ideologies. This move triggered a substantial backlash from Albertans concerned over the potential negative impacts on their energy-dependent economy. While some view Nenshi's stance as a pragmatic approach to fostering federal-provincial cooperation, others perceive it as a betrayal of Alberta's interests, leading to widespread social media outcry and public protests. Media coverage, both local and national, has played a crucial role in shaping public opinion, highlighting the polarization of viewpoints surrounding this endorsement. If you take a minute to visit our website, sign the petition demanding Justin Trudeau leave the office immediately and sign up for our newsletter to get uncensored news on Canadian politics. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more updates. Nenshi's political career stands at a crossroads due to his contentious endorsement. While the backlash could harm his popularity among conservative voters, it might simultaneously position him as a leading figure for those advocating progressive and pragmatic policies in Alberta. If he can demonstrate the tangible benefits of his stance, such as federal support for local projects, he may regain trust even among skeptics. Alternatively, this controversy could begin a new political chapter for Nenshi at the federal level where his perspectives might find a broader, more receptive audience. As Alberta continues to navigate its complex political identity, the outcomes of this controversy will likely influence provincial-federal dynamics and the broader political landscape.